So, as Jerry does not have a vehicle and he can no longer arrive at 7.30 due to public transportation, I think the best idea would be to uh, adjust the shifts so that way a different employee can come in at Jerry's scheduled time of 7.30, which then allows Jerry to be scheduled for 7.45, he is, which is the time that he usually shows up when he's scheduled for 7.30. As a manager, I think it's important to understand that different employees have uh, different uh, situations and each employee needs to be able to perform their best. And if given the opportunity to come in when is best for them, and it still works out for the company, then they'll be able to perform their best. If another employee is scheduled for 7.30 instead of Jerry, they will be able to perform the tasks that Jerry does in that shift, and Jerry will come in at a different shift and perform the tasks that are supposed to be done then. He'll still be there before opening and still be able to help out, and then he'll be able to help with the store during regular hours. I think it's important to take everybody's situation into account because there are some things that employees can control and some things that employees can't control. Losing your vehicle and having to take public transportation is something you cannot control. And I think his situation needs to be addressed so he can still be at work at the time that works for him and works for the company.